morning everybody good morning good morning good morning I'm trusting that everybody is feeling fresh today I'm trusting that you are strong I'm trusting that you are having an excellent week so far it kind of blows my mind that it's Thursday already it feels like only one or two days have gone by yet at the same time it feels like two months have gone by just in this week so I'm trusting that everybody's keeping their disciplines down I'm trusting that you you're busy marking and grounding yourself in every single day just to remind yourself that it's not one blur we are taking things day by day by day discipline is a day by day journey it's not it's not one big picture right it's a long-term journey that's made up of very very small steps right that's how we build habits that's how we build disciplines that's how we build lifestyles is you start one percent at a time very seldom that you're going to go and every single day make huge 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 progress right we're not we're not designed that way that every single day we're making massive progress we're not always supposed to be hustling and bustling and busy right we're supposed to we're supposed to become human beings not human doings right so in the end what we're looking for is just a small consistent improvement each and every single day so for me for instance I've noticed a huge difference just in, in my legs, in my fitness, in my body as I've been squatting. It's a huge difference between who I am today and who it was that started this challenge uh, back three, three odd weeks ago. All right, so keep track of your progress, keep track of who you were when you started, who you were in the middle and who you are now. Keep track of your progress just to remind yourself what an excellent job you've done. Because if you have been squatting every day with me so far, I can promise you, you have changed, you have grown stronger, you have grown fitter, you have grown better, you've grown stronger. Right? If you haven't been squatting every day, don't stress about it. But every day that you have been squatting, you've been taking directions towards, oh, you, sorry, you've been taking steps in the direction of who you want to be. Every day that you haven't squatted, for every day that you've missed out, those are the days that you've stayed still and actually slid a little bit further away from who you want to be. So we've been talk we talked about it quite a bit at the beginning, who do you want to be at the end of this lockdown period? Who do you want to walk out of your front door and go and interact with the world? Remember the world is, might look vaguely the same, but it is not going to be the same when we get back out there. We are going to have to adapt ourselves to the world. The world is a different place than what we remember it. So today, squats are like an apple. Right? They're like an apple because if you take a bite out of an apple. You don't know what it tastes like before you've taken the bite. Right? You've got no idea just by looking at it if it's sweet or sour. You've got no idea just by staring at it if it's floury on the inside or nice and sweet and juicy and crispy. Right? So squats are the same way. Is you can look at it and judge them all you want. You can look at it from the outside and go, yeah, I don't like that. All right? But until you're doing them every single day, you don't understand it. Right? The same way that if I have never eaten an apple in my life, and I choose this apple as my first one, I take a bite out of it and it's horrible, right? I can't turn around and say, oh, all apples are horrible. I'm not a fan of apples. I hate apples, all right? That's not a fair judgment. It's not a fair conclusion because you've only had one, right? By the same token, you can't just squat a little bit, one or two or three days. You can't just squat for a small amount of time and then say, no, I don't like the squats. The squats don't work for me. The squats don't benefit me. It doesn't work like that. You need to give it time. If you want to find out if you like apples or not, well, you're going to have to try lots of different apples. You have to try different varieties, different sizes, different seasons of apples to find out if you like them or not, to find out if they work for you or not. All right, so squats are the same way. Don't give up on them just because they're a little bit uncomfortable. All right, the old saying, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. So, that just means that eating healthy, uh, eating healthy means your body is healthier. You tend to go to the doctor less. I think squats are very similar as well. Squatting every day keeps the doctor away because the more squats you do, the more discipline in your your mind, your body, your heart, your soul that you're busy building, and from discipline comes a healthy lifestyle. I can promise you this. I used to lead an incredibly unhealthy lifestyle, but discipline was the one key factor that changed my entire mind around. So. Like that clip that I put into our groups yesterday, discipline is going the extra mile. It's doing the extra one. It's doing what you have to do even if there is nothing in you that wants to do it. So I've given the example before, but like, uh, but again, this morning I woke up and there was very, there was a, only a small part of me that actually wanted to get up and do squats. The rest of me said, please let's stay in bed. It's cold, it's dark, it's windy. 
and we don't want to go do this. And I wanted to listen to my body and go rest again. But I had to turn around, apply self-discipline, simply say, that's cool, we can rest later. We, you know, we can rest tonight. Right now, there's something that we have to do. Right now, we've committed to something, and we have to honor that commitment no matter how it feels, no matter how I feel about it. So discipline is doing what you have to do, no matter how you feel about it. All right, so let's get these squats going. I know we don't always feel like it, but trust me, they are building you. They are building you into a stronger warrior, into a better person, into a stronger human. Get our squats done for the day, and then we're going to do a, a bit of a warm-up morning class as well. I must say, after the double up day yesterday, uh, the, the double up day the day before, and the backpack yesterday with the weight in, my legs are actually sore properly for the first time this challenge. I'm mostly feeling it up in my calves, up the back of my legs. It's from you know, the extra weight that I had yesterday. But I can honestly say it, this morning, yeah, my legs are burning. So this is a bit of a challenge for me this morning. I need to push through the burn. I need to push through the pain. If you're feeling some pain in your legs, remember you're not alone. Do it with me. We're in this together. We're here to hold each other accountable. All right? Let's get going. Get rid of burn, so do more squats. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Remember to breathe. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Do everyone properly. Fifteen. 16, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, halfway, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, oh my thighs are burning, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, keep breathing, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, keep it going, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, keep it going, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 
100. 101 plus an extra one just because it's 102. Whew. Ah. So, after the double up day and the weight of squats yesterday, ah, my thighs and my calves are busy complaining bitterly. Right, very well done for your squats today. Remember, every day that you do squats might not change your life, right? Doing one day of squats won't change your life. Doing one day and doing another day and doing another day and doing another day and doing another day, you eventually build up an incredible stack of discipline in your squats. So just remember, squats, they start as a physical discipline, but it becomes a mental discipline. If you want to show that you have physical and mental discipline, right, then do it. Don't tell me about it. The biggest problem people have is they think that doing the squats for a week shows their discipline. It doesn't, right? That shows that you get excited for a challenge for a week and then forget about it. Right? That's just a physical discipline. To do the ABS squat challenge for 20 days running, right? that is mental discipline because I've not felt like it every single morning. There truly are mornings where I wanted to go back to bed, but I've been here and I've done it. So if you've been squatting consistently as well, I'm incredibly proud of you because at this point, you are showing far more than just physical discipline. You are showing a level of mental discipline that it takes many, 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 many years of study and practice to attain and to master. So very, very well done for everybody who came out and squatted this morning. I'm seriously proud of you. Right? Remember, to make your mind stronger, right? read. Fill your mind with good food. So like you would fill your body with food, like you would eat the apple to keep your body healthy, eat an apple a day mentally to keep your mind healthy. Read every day. Read something that makes you better. Read something from a wiser person than yourself. Right? Go and fill your mind with good things. Fill your mind with good things, it will it will ripple out into the rest of your life, into your body, into your disciplines, into your work, into your school, into everything that you do. Right? So build your physical discipline, build your mental discipline, and see where it takes. So we're gonna do a nice morning session um, as well after this. I'm gonna end the stream, start up for a morning beach training session. So come join me to get your heart rate up. It's a bit of a, a warm-up, some basic shooting some movements, and a nice stretch to get the day going. Have an excellent one, everybody. Remember, be safe, be sane, be sensible, and be squatting. Have an excellent day. See you guys for the next one.